Good afternoon, young lady. I'm Congressional Planetary Senator Marshall Allen Breeson. Please, let me help you. I'm Emma Dante. I'm one of the surviving children from the planet Rythar. I carry the sickness that will kill you and everyone on Earth. Listen to me for two minutes before you blast my ship. I rode the God Transport up to the Guardian Station because I had to know what was above the rain mist. In the answer house, you would not tell us. Now I understand why. We were children. You, you were waiting for us to mature. And that's the mistake you made. That blindness nearly destroyed your civilization. You will have to build another guardian station. This time, don't hide anything from us because we're children. The truth makes us mature, not illusions or taboos. It's easier to face a fact than to have to give up a dream we've been taught to believe. Tell your kids the truth when they ask for it. Tell us, please. We can adjust to it. We're just as human as you are. I'm ready. Send up your warships. Just destroy me.
Emma, I understand. Please allow me to explain. For ten years, Dr. Jameson has been telling us from the Guardian Station that we should adopt a different educational policy towards Rythar. Your scare broadcast was clever, but we're used to Jameson's tricks. He'll be removed from office for this, if I have anything to say about it. You didn't believe me? Of course not. If a plague carrier escaped from Rythar, we would have heard about it long before this. The trouble with you scientists is you don't grant the rest of us any common sense. And Jameson's the worst of the lot. He's always contended that the sociologists should determine our Rytherian policy, not the elected representatives of the people. Let's have no more dramatics, please. You don't know how fortunate you are, young lady. If the politicians were as addle-witted as you scientists claim we are, we might have believed that nonsense and blasted your ship out of the sky. You scientists have to give up the notion that you're our guardians. We're quite able to look out for ourselves.